Hey, this is Digital by Computing. Today we're gonna to talk about the new Notes app on iOS 11. It has got a whole bunch of great new features. We're gonna log into my phone right now and have a look at how it works. So I'll go ahead and open up the Notes app on my iPhone. And straight away from my notes, you can see that the view looks slightly different than it did previously. So there's a new old notes, I guess, menu at the top. Um, yours will obviously have the name of your notes. I can click on plus to create a brand new note. And you'll straight away see that there's a few different options down the bottom. So I can create tables. All right, nice and easy. I can select the table. I can then go ahead and copy it, share it, delete it, etc. can easily navigate through that. I can go to the A here, I can actually change a whole th a whole number of things. I can add some, you know, some numbers or some bullet points. I can change bold, italics, underline, etc. and scroll between the different types of headings and body and title, etc. can type in some text. It's automatically going to create my bullet points here. Let's see if I can create a number. Create some test text. Next, it's gonna create the new number. I can plus, I can actually go and scan a document, take photos or videos, scan my, uh, sketch my uh, photo library or actually do a sketch. So I can create a sketch and I can go ahead and draw in here. All right, I can change the different talk different type of uh, pencil. And it actually will sense how hard or how soft I'm actually pushing, which is quite cool. You can see a ruler, you know, and some nice uh, rubber outs as well done. And I'll add that into my notes directly. Quite good features. I can add people straight into my notes so that everyone can see the latest changes. So I can actually add my friends um, straight into my notes app. So in the top right there, I've got the arrow pointing upwards to get me some different options. I can got the message apps, mail, etc., which is what you had previously where I can send that notes on. But then I've got a few options down the bottom such as save to files, which is essentially the new um, folder file management application for iOS. Uh, similar to the Finder on the Mac or Windows Explorer on Windows. I can go find in notes, I can do a search, I can do some writing feedback, which is actually quite a cool feature. All right, if I go back in there, I can lock my notes, so I can assign a password. I can also activate Touch ID mm -hmm. to securely secure the notes. I can go and put some lines and grids directly into my notes also, and I can create a PDF. So I can actually convert that notes document into a PDF. I can click on done, I can save the file to a particular location, or I can just delete the PDF straight from there. So that is a summary of the notes application. So if you found that video helpful, please like it and subscribe to my channel, Digital by Computing, just on the button there for more videos.